This is my glitter soul patch. 2020 mustaches will be <laughs> tiny, tiny, this tiny, and jeweled. Horrible thing I've ever You've seen. Heard Hi everyone, welcome to what we stole from the beauty closet. We've done this for a few weeks now, so if yeah. you haven't seen our past episodes, go back in the depths of YouTube and find them. <laughs> but anyway, today we're talking about nails. I'm Lauren Balsamo, the senior beauty editor. I'm Chloe Mesker, also the senior beauty editor. And I'm Ruby Budmeyer, beauty editor. Oh, we're talking about all things nails. Rubes, what do you have? Ooh. Fancy Chanel. Yes. Tell us. Starting with this very luxe hand cream. It's a little egg. Put it, it on my hands. Make egg. me feel like a fancy rich lady. It smells amazing. It's very fresh. I also hate hand cream and I never wear it because yeah, it just feels greasy and kind of like gross on me. Yeah, for some reason. type or anything. Um, and this is one that I actually really love. The it only... soaks in so fast. I know, and it just feels soft and kind of dewy. Comes out kind of pink. It smells very floral, but yeah. not overwhelming. Oh, it's nice. Like it's not very like grandma-y, which I feel like some floral hand creams are. Guys, look at my hands. <laughs> <laughs> Can I hold it and feel fancy? Please. I feel like that's what I hate about hand creams is like, like I do this with my hand creams so right. that they don't get on my fingertips. But then that doesn't help my with my actual cuticles. Yeah. This right. feels like very lightweight, like it's not gonna exactly. grease up or stick to things. If you're into taking like pictures of your manicure, like how nice if you like do are doing a fancy the, like, mani the grab and then, like, like that. it as a right. prop. Yeah. I've never done that, but if I did, I think it would be amazing. <laughs> like I'll just like out. lift this out of my bag and be like, oh, does anyone need hand cream? <laughs> it's Chanel. Oh, are your, are your nails okay? <laughs> the only downside is that it's $65. It's fine. You'll feel um, rich <laughs> as <laughs> when you take it out of your bag. You know when you just want to spend a lot of money, like not spend a lot of money, but you want a designer thing just to be like, oh, I own this thing. Like I remember going that into Sephora. That feels good. And yeah. It feels good to yeah. have like something that's actually useful and designery. Can't Again. afford Chanel clothes, probably. Yeah, no, <laughs> not me. The yeah. next best thing. This works. Um, what do you have? My favorite thing in the entire world, you they all know this because I talk about them constantly and I only wear yeah. them. It's the Olive and June nail stickers. $7.50 for one sheet of, I don't know, like, a bajillion stickers. These nail stickers, I've written a story about them before. The link is below. The designs are just really cute and minimalist. These are right now like- Are those little lashes These are it? little lashes. They also I have like that. cacti and inner tubes and palm trees and it's inner just like- tubes for all your bachelorette parties. For all your bachelorette parties. Oh, really, it's tubes. cute. So I'll kind of bend the plastic like this and the sticker naturally comes off a bit. So I put that sticker, I got these little hearts. Gonna put it just mm. haphazardly on, that is actually not the worst on my thumb, and you have those two little, oh, it's cute. yeah, it little hearts. With that nail so color. I usually don't paint my nails first. I'll just do a base coat of clear. I'll put a nail sticker on. I'll cover it with a top coat. I've had these stickers on for two full weeks without them chipping or flaking, and I've had That's to like kind of almost like get them off with nail polish remover at the end. But they're feel how flush they are. They're not like the Wait, edges. Can I just awesome. put it on a clean nail, or do I have to have a? Base yeah, you can coat put it on, on a clean nail. My nails are so janky right now. Don't Good. Show them, show a close up to the camera. Horrible looking cuticle. Don't look. Don't look. This is cute. Wow. Yeah, they're very cute, and they have so many different designs. You can get them at oliveandjune.com. They're really cheap and affordable, and I love them so much. Okay, so because my cuticles, as you just saw, are usually disgusting, this is my favorite little Manny thing. Dr. Hauschka knee, nail, and cuticle pen. It's a mouthful, but it's really just a cuticle stick with cuticle oil in it. Oh, cool. Like it has this. like a slightly beveled um, like edge so that you can go in and push your nail back like your cuticles that get gross and overgrown like mine. And then it's infused with cuticle oil to soften them. I know you're not like totally supposed to do this, but I love to cut my cuticles because they're disgusting otherwise. So this is a really good like prep thing if you're doing them at home. It looks like a like a Sharpie tip almost. Yeah, or like a it's, highlighter it's, tip. It's that like type that of... type of material. It's infused with neem oil, which is good for your actual nails. And then it has apricot oil and one other like planty oil. Uh, oh, oh, chamomile. Mm -hmm. And that's like really good for your skin and it gets rid of like redness, inflammation, hangnails, like all that jazz. What That's are those smart. little tips? Oh, and you are... get spares. Wait, I like that a so lot. So when this like eventually dries out, actually it takes like months for this to dry out. Oh. But yeah, you just take it out oh, and then baby. put the new one in. I feel like in the past I've used those cuticle oils that are almost like a dropper. Oh but it's yeah, so and messy. then they get such a mess, everywhere. So I never use it. No, no this no, is like, like not it. messy. And then any excess, I, I just sort of like rub in. No, I'm. You did that the opposite. Oh, sorry. I'm not. <laughs> that's, <laughs> no, mine. that's mine. How it's much like 
is it? I think it's 18, it's $19, so it's mm. like not that expensive considering you get like Multiple three tips. replacement heads. And you can get it at drhaushka.com. I've also seen it on Amazon. Even if you don't do your nails, when your cuticles look nice, you're just like, ah, it's very poly. This yeah, is yeah. Like nice. Like yeah. I look like I paid attention. It's also natural. Dr. Hauschka is a natural brand, mm. so I look love at that. that. For you. It's very unbranded for me. Okay, also I'm looking at this because this feels very festive for what tell yes. me. Okay, so paint box, the really cute nail salon in Zoho. Um, I love paint box nail York. polish now. Um, and they come in these little um, duos. It's called a power couple. This one is called um, like spring, and I think this one is like spice. And they're meant to be worn together, which I kind of love because I feel like mixed color manicures are very much having a thing yeah now. oh like and that like, like radiant nail yes. or like an, that's very cool and i'm not artistic enough to pick the colors myself like i feel like yeah i don't really know so they're all pre-selected and like they really complement that. each other who has I'm bare nails that wants me, to paint me, this me. on let me try up that it this just comes off I know because yeah. it's so hard to paint when with those lid square like really lids. Like I that. hate yeah. those. Yeah, I really feel like that would also too. look really pretty on darker skin tone. This brush is like very skin. suited to my nail. Can I try the other one just to see how they look together? Cute. This is fun. How much is this, Rubes? Um, the set is Can't forty, it. Huh. and it also is a good gift. Like I hate to be that person and say everything is a good gift, but like it is. Yeah, but I it know. comes in yeah. a very cute box together. Like no, you're not that person. This holidays. is not a good gift. This is weird. Like if someone gave me this, I'd be like, yeah, thanks. Wow. But buy for yourself. You. <laughs> buy for yourself. Yeah. Show the people your fingers. Well, I, um, I did kind of a bad job, but you get the idea. The colors look really nice next to each other. God, you put me on the frigging spot. You're doing it on camera, so people are gonna need to I see just it. To see your, your hands don't look terrible. No, my my, it's not. That's not great. Um, these are cute. I like yeah, these. I'm into this. Okay. Um, oh, and so once you use these, you want to finish with a top coat, which is where my favorite top coat comes in. Sally Hansen Miracle Gel Top Coat. I do not like gel nails for myself. Same. I think they are not the greatest over time because they dry out your nails. So I try to get the same results at home. This is part of the gel nail polish line that Sally has. They're not, they don't need to be treated with like a UV light or any type of light. They're just a little sturdier, a little thicker, a little shinier than a normal nail polish and they last longer. I use this over any nail polish. I was and gonna it say, can I you, try it now? I yeah, put it on even top. though it's like, well, maybe wait lock for it to dry in. a bit, but lock this in. <laughs> it, it is just like a thicker, glossier, longer lasting finish. I'll say like with a normal top coat, I can get five days with my nails looking good before it starts to, you know, chip or like come out off around the cuticles. With this, I get like, I'd say like eight to nine days. It really does Oh, Give me a really few good. more days. Still comes off very easily with nail polish remover. This always happens when you use like a, a light, light nail polish. You start to see like ridges a little bit, yeah. but this like totally smooth them out. It's almost like a filter. It like feels kind of thick and then like Yeah, yeah. Nice. It just blurs everything out because it is thick, so it fills in everything. It makes it look really nice. I only use this as a top coat now. I mean, you'll get better results if you use it with the Sally Hansen gel-like yeah. nail polish, but I also want to mix and match. So you could use it on top of anything. You can get it at drugstores, Ulta, Amazon, and it's only $10. Cool. Highly recommend. Yeah. yeah, I love it. I'm gonna try that. Okay, so because I am lazy when I do my nails, and will never use a base coat, base coat or a top coat, I'm like just not that person. I, I know, I know. <laughs> this is saving my life. Essie Expressy. It's Cute. amazing. Cute. Okay, Cute. so everyone loves Essie. It's like my favorite nail polish brand ever. This is their newest collection. It's a quick dry nail color and you don't need a base coat and you don't need a top coat. So it's like hmm. very speedy. It dries in a minute. So when the brand came to our oh, office a couple weeks ago to like let us preview it with a celebrity nail artist and they were like, it dries in a minute. And in my head, I'm like, no frigging way does it dry in a minute. <laughs> Where you came back from that meeting, you were very jazzed about it. Yeah. Oh, I was like, guys, oh my God, guys, it dries in a minute. It's so good. The brush shape is designed to make your at home like DIY mani easier. Hold on, let me put my timer on. 60 seconds on the clock. Six. But anyway, so 40 shades and they're all gender neutral, which I think is really cool. And although any nail polish can be gender neutral. Okay, well these saying. colors are This is really cute. Look at neutral. that. Yeah, and good. they're inspired by Gen Z, so Does that mean it's automatically cool? Is I don't it know. Something yeah. that we wouldn't understand. I don't know. I'm a millennial, but I think it's cool. I'm a is millennial, it yeah. Visco girl colors? Ew, don't say that. I hate it. <laughs> I, oh yeah, wait, did I cheat by blowing on it? No, this is know. normal. I'm People sure that this. really didn't make a difference. It's nine dollars. Oh, it's been a minute. Okay, 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 stop. Ooh, one more thing. Okay, someone touch it. It's, dry. it's really dry. 
I like, and you just like aggressively wow. stroke. Right my now, like, yeah. yeah. I am aggressively stroking her <laughs> finger right okay, now. Whatever. That's how I always test the tackiness. Yeah. I push on it. I go, oh no, it's my fingerprint. Yeah. Uh, this is not leaving a fingerprint no, like, at you, all. You should really buy this. That's and that was opaque. You did one. One coat. You did one coat. No base coat. That's no really impressive. Coat. Quick dry I nail color. True to its name. <laughs> buy it. That's awesome. Oh, okay. So every single episode, um, if you're new to this or if you just forgot, we have a product that all of us agree that we love. Oh, Holy Grail. Yes. Holy Grail product. Our Holy Grail product for this I need episode right now. <laughs> that you need right now is the Qtex Swipe and Go Nail Polish Remover Pads. You love these especially, I right? I love them. You always notice your nails looking disgusting at the most inconvenient times. Like, I don't know, like on my way to someone's wedding and I'll look down and I'll be like, what the f <laughs> So what you need is this to make your cuticles look nice and this to get rid of any like scrappy, chipped, disgusting nail polish on your fingernails and you just leave it in your bag. I feel like a lot of nail polish removers, you know your fingertips just get like white after and you're like, all of my moisture is gone, what have I done? This has linseed oil and a little bit of apricot kernel oil, which is... Apricot for the win. Apricot for the win. It's gonna hydrate. It's not gonna leave you like feeling greasy, but it, by the time you wash your nail polish off and your nails, it's, your nails are gonna feel fine. Do you ever take off red nail polish and oh, there's like this red And then it just like gets on your fingers too. It really That's doesn't a rinse. happen. Yeah. It's like, okay, so you use the one side to take it off and then I just flip it over and use that to like quickly clean up my skin and it, it's totally fine. It's like, I, feel I like bring them on vacation because how many times you like go on a beach vacation, your cute mani looks nice for the yep. first two days and then you're like, oh my God, this is disgusting. How much are these? Um, they're definitely less than $10 <laughs> and you can get them at the drugstore. At the end of every episode, we do an unboxing. So we're just gonna clear all this off. What are we unboxing, you guys? Oh, sparkly. Ha! Um, so if people don't know what this is, we get a lot of packages every single day and sometimes they're packaged very cutely and they hold surprises and products inside. So we decided to do one with you instead of just by ourselves. Uh, we don't know what's in here. We know it's from Mac, but we're we're gonna do this all together and figure Any out. Any guesses? Makeup. <laughs> I'm guessing oh my some God. like little lip or something. <laughs> I'm guessing. I'm guessing glitter eyeshadow palette. Holiday. Oh, holiday makes sense. Oh, stars. Cute. Lots of stars. <laughs> so this first thing that I have are apparently stickers for your lips. Silver sparks adornment face and body glitter. This is the time I put these on my face. Wowza. This one is very special. Wow, put it on. I'm gonna put this one on. Okay, what are you putting on? I don't know. God. This is my glitter soul patch. Ridiculous. It is not Look. super sticking to my face. Is it coming off? Because <laughs> yeah, I feel like off. it's a little gone now. I would like it like it's like a little wing or something. What well, guess what, Ruby? No. <laughs> You're a fairy, Ruby. <laughs> 2020 mustaches will be tiny, <laughs> tiny, the tiny, most and jeweled. Horrible thing I've ever You've seen. Heard. This is so cute. Do you I see know. that? It's Look like, at that. It's like it looks like 3D printed almost. Fun. Lauren, it looks like, so natural. So this would be like my, you know, more every colors. day to work look. <laughs> Wait, this is kind of cool. It's actually not. You this. look good. Like that's like the funny thing about it. There's also silver. Also, this feels Can really I put nice. Put this on top. I mean, sure. This is an ombre look with blue and silver. If oh you put it on just the middle of the mouth, it really just gives um, a very full lip look. Look You're at this ridiculous. contour. No, I don't, I don't know about that. Like if you wore this in the office, you'd be like, okay. Like there's, I, yeah, yeah. no, 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 I'm not just saying. At, like, I'm not just saying. Where people do that. Yeah, like, I if you're like a third grade teacher, like no. You can do whatever you want. Don't let Lauren okay, you shoot you do. down. But maybe if you're anything. a lawyer, no. <gasps> there's a purple. I think it makes your lips, I mean your teeth look yellow. I think a lot of things make your teeth look yellow. No, purple for sure does. I have beef with it. There's gold. This I would wear. This I would wear to like That's a really party. pretty. That's cute. This is the purple one. Rubes, what's that? It is a very sparkly, very purple lip gloss. Bambi, Bambi. Um, I already have some lip stuff on, but I'm just gonna see what happens. It's a it's... little bit sticky, but like you can't have it all. Cool color, nice packaging. Don't I believe mean, well, you can pretty. have it all. Finally grew muscles and was able to open this. Pretty awesome. Ooh, there are more colors. Wait, let's get them all open. This is awesome. This is very cool. I respect Matt. glitter. It's like a very disco. Can you see thing. the glitter? I'm here for it. It's it's like really? velour. It's, yeah, this it's like is velvety. such a cool. Yeah, it's like velvety velour, and I love or like or like corduroy. How it blends? It's very pigmented, um, and then it can also be blended out. Oh, how oh, pretty! Color. Oh, is this the other one? Yeah, I feel like that color is more for me. This color is more for you. This really, isn't surprising that no, Mac has like good makeup. Is, it's like really awesome textures, amazing color payoff. Like 
if they're gonna do something sparkly, like it's really, it's like great sparkly. sparkly. This is cool. This was really fun. Thanks for sending this. This has been We Stole with Chloe. Lauren. <laughs> Ruby. <No. laughs> Make sure that you click the bell to get notifications so that you can always know when we're coming back yeah, so you can watch this again us. if you like it, which if you don't, please don't tell us in the comments. If there is something you wanna know if you like have tried this or you have tried a lip gloss that you really like or you have a tip for applying fake lashes so we're not scared of it, please put it in the comments below um, and make sure to watch the previous episodes because we've done them and they're great and you'll have fun for hours. Did she sell you? She sold me. Oh, okay, thank bye you. guys. Bye.